Hey y'all. <coughs> I don't think I'm going to be wasting too much of y'all's time today. Um, just sitting here watching the CNN. They're all talking about NSA back on the news, you know, and these other countries are now pissed off because apparently the government's been spying on their shit. Y'all, come on. See, I thought that damn people in America were stupid. You know, in our government. I thought they were stupid. <laughs> no. No, 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 no. No, they're not as stupid as the other damn governments, apparently, because, I mean, come the fuck on. You're not America, so we're going to spy on you. It doesn't matter if you're our friend or not. I mean, it's the American government. Are you serious? How can you actually think for one second, just because you say that you're friends with them, that they're not going to be spying on you? I mean, come on. Are you out of your fucking mind? I mean, y'all need to look into some history, okay? Find out about Alexandria, okay? And find out about the laws of Alexandria, okay? And you'll fucking understand more towards what the damn United States government does and what the fuck Library of Congress is all about, and you'll be able to piece it together yourself. I mean, if you think for a second that America doesn't listen to everybody's everythings, you're out of your fucking mind. Here it is. Newspaper claims the agency spied on more than 70 million phone calls during a 30-day period. That report, based on documents leaked by former NSA contractor Edward Snowden. But the anger isn't just limited to France. In Mexico, the government so there vowed stupid. to investigate reports that the NSA hacked into the public email of former President Felipe Calderon. Officials there calling the actions against international law unforgivable. CNN foreign affairs correspondent uh, is at the state this morning. Like we give a fuck about international law, and when I say we, I mean our government, United States government. That's just insane. That's just insane. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Mexico, France, and every other fucking country out there. We listen to everything everybody says. Everything. Okay, since 1979, they've recorded all phone calls. Okay, whenever it's all phone calls, it's not saying all the phone calls in the USA. It's all phone calls. When they said that, hey, we can now record all emails... That's not saying that they're talking about all of your emails. It's all emails ever created, okay? Every video that I've ever made, okay, is a fucking flag. I mean, period. You know, I mean, I've probably got more flags than the fucking UN. I'm serious, y'all. You just don't understand how the damn system works, okay? They're taking everybody's everything information in... They're compiling it all together so they can find out exactly what you will do in case of a certain situation. <sighs> dumbasses, dumbasses, dumbasses. All these damn countries are fucking stupid if they think for one second that everything they're doing. We're America. We spy on everybody. Everybody. America's more paranoid than I'll ever be considered. You know what I'm saying? They're... No, I, I don't even got nothing else to say about it, y'all. I don't even know what else to say. You know what I'm saying? This is just stupid as fuck, okay? If, I don't care. Okay, check it out. I got this one cat, right, asking me about, um, uh, you know, different operating systems and different shit, you know, should I use Tor, should I use, you know, this, that, and the other. And, um, you know, just like I told him, you know, there's no sense in it. You know what I'm saying? You look up anything. Okay, if you get on a computer and you sign up and you start searching the web for those programs that help keep you hidden and help keep you from being anonymous, you know, help you from, you know, to be anonymous, you're sending out flags right then and then more eyes watch you the whole time you build up your thing. I mean, it's just that easy. And then once you get it figured out, they look at all the different anonymous things and they see when... You quit searching when you started to do your other stuff and vanished, and then when this one popped up. I mean, it's analytics, y'all. I mean, 
Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Trade accounts. You know what I'm saying? That's what I know a lot of people do. They trade accounts. They make it be an email account and they fill it up and they trade it. You need to check yes to all the spam, whatever. Everything is known. Okay? It's been game over. Okay? That's why we are a resistance. Okay? Because they've already gotten control. Okay? So, I'm going to go ahead and dip. I'm checking out some of the stuff they had in the carry-on bag. That's hilarious right there. That's hilarious. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. The dry ice bombs. Are you fucking kidding me? Dry ice bombs? Oh. Okay, look, y'all. You get a two-liter bottle, right? You fuck, put water in it. You crush the bottle. You crush a piece of dry ice. You put it in there. You flip the bottle upside down so the water hits dry ice, and you throw it. It's fucking loud. It's fucking hilarious. It's not a bomb. Okay? They're talking about the dry ice bombs. Are you fucking kidding me now that dry ice containers are considered bombs? Oh, they're fucking out their fucking mind. You know what I'm saying? I'm out. I'm out. I'm going to watch whales.